Hey everybody, how's it going and welcome to another uh, tutorial. In today's video, what I wanted to show you is how to set up a gportal server and add mods to it. So before you do anything, head over to gportal.com uh, and get yourself a server. And if you need 10% off your server, use the link in the description. The next thing you want to do is once your server's set up, I want you to come down to File Manager. And you'll see here um, all the stuff that's going to open up now. It does take a little while on some servers, so give it time. If it says directory is empty, just give it a minute or two. Eventually, you'll see uh, come up and you have the directories. It'll be home, how, content, packs. And then in the packs folder, I want you to click create new directory and put in mods. Like so. Okay. When it's like that, then I want you to go and find the mod you're looking for on either the Nexus or Cars or whatever one you're using to find the mod. Now, some notes before we get into the action, right? Um, use mods at your own risk. It is an early access game and there are problems that are to be expected. If problems arise due to mods, just remove them by right clicking and deleting i'll show you how to do that in a minute there are two different types of mods there are mods with pack and mods without pack so bat file non-bat file okay uh gpol servers only support pack files okay that's pack extensions only we do not support ue4 ssre or re ue4 ss github Okay, so what I want you to do is find a pack file. The easiest way to do that is head over to, say, for example, the Nexus, and then you're looking for mods that are like uh, character based ones or things like that. So let's say, for example, you do endorsements like that, and then you're just going to go through and find the one that you're looking for. So, for example, I've got Zoe on this one. That's what I'm going to do. Now, when you change a pack skin in the game, it will change for absolutely everybody. So every female in the game will now look like Zo, okay? To you. And to everybody else. That everybody will be Zo when they create their character. Previous main characters will appear, appear with their face invisible, or they could appear as, like, some other bits and bobs. So let me show you two variations. This is on my server that I already have a character on and you can see here that my face is invisible that's because the pack has replaced that character okay so joining a new server um, and I get to create a character again you can now see that the character is so and I can't ch I can't really change anything so apart from it being a male if I do different females I can add a little bits and bobs here and that's about it, but I would just, as is, but as you start the game and you progress into the game, you will see other players who have female bodies who all be exactly the same. So let's jump over to this area here. And if I see anybody, which I don't, um, which is kind of random considering it's an online public server, um, but you can see here that I've gotten Zoe and she's modded into the game. But how did we do that? So let's get to it. So on once you've downloaded the mob, uh, the mod, oh, the mod. What well, the first thing you want to do is come over here and you'll see uh, your Steam library, the Steam apps, common, how world, how content, hacks, and then I want you to make a folder. In that folder. It looks like that, okay? So that's right next to the ender key. I'm not actually sure what it's called, but whatever. Um, you're just gonna put that folder in there and then you're gonna download your mod, for example, Zoe, and then I'm gonna drag and drop it in there, okay? Now for your server, what you're gonna do is head over to your server and we're going to right click and create a new directory in content so it's home, how, content, packs, and we're going to make and create new directory, and it's the same again. Then we're going to click upload, and we're going to click here and drag in the Zoe file. Now this is so everybody else on your server can see the same as you. 
okay? You don't need to do it sing if you just want yourself to see it. But if you want to everybody to see it, that's how they do it. They also need that file as well. So make sure you share it with your friends. This is the mods are on the server. Okay? Now, for example, what I'm going to do is delete this on my PC. Okay? And I'm going to load the game up and we're going to see if it works on um, just on my screen or if anybody's going to get it. Make sure you start your server once you've, you've saved it and you see it there. It's in the mods folder. Uh, if it's not in the mods folder, drag it in um, to that folder. Just remember that the Gport website is slow in this area because you're doing it live. Okay, so if it shows here, it could be wrong. Make sure it's in the mods folder, not the packs folder. Grab that and just delete it. Exact same way if, say, if you're getting rid of a mod. Okay, if you don't want the mod, just get rid of it. So make sure your server's stopped, right? Wait for this to reload and then go to that directory like so and then upload grab your file grab it and then start uploading like so it takes its time but it's, that's how it's done and hopefully that'll help you mod your server which you go now like i said before guys if you have any issues at any time okay you must delete the mod okay so just go in there right click delete but always like modding many issues do occur now for power servers that were created before january 26 2024 the server files must be verified what uh for this to work um this is not necessary for newly created servers okay so if you're not sure how to do that right um we'll get to that in a sec so to verify your game files and make sure you're ready for modding click on the status page and then scroll down to verify game files click it add it that's how it's done then go through the same steps again file manager let the directory load up then it's content packs create new folder and done okay thank you very much for watching another tutorial guys i hope this helps you out have a great day